If you own a 2009 to 2014 Ford F-150 with a blown speaker in the door, today I'm going to show you how to fix it. What's up guys, Greg here from CarID.com. Welcome back to the shop and today we're going to be working on this 2014 Ford F-150 and unfortunately it's got a blown driver's side speaker. Now I'm going to show you how to remove the door panel to get to the speaker and replace it and a lot of those tips and tricks of removing an interior door panel you can use on any maker model car. Once we get that off I'll show you the simple and easy process of replacing a speaker and before you know it we'll have this thing back together and some tunes blaring but let's not wait any longer and let's get to work. Removing an interior door panel on any car or truck is pretty similar and it's an easy job you can do at home. They're secured with a series of screws and plastic clips and retainers that actually snap into the steel door. Now the trick is, is to inspect the door panel thoroughly and find all of those screws that secure it. Some are hidden behind tiny little covers. I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about. So this is a really good example. A lot of door panels have these tiny little covers that you can lift up using a pocket screwdriver. And behind it is a nut that needs to be removed before this panel can come off. Now this one's going to be an eight millimeter. I'm just going to remove that right now. All right, now in this truck, there's going to be two more screws at the very bottom of the door panel, uh, six millimeters, and will also need to be removed. You're going to have one here on the outside, and then the other right here on the inside. A pick set, an angled 90 degree pick, is probably the best to be able to get behind that. Yep, and pop it right out, and there's our screw. Eight millimeter screw. And like I said, guys, a lot of these things are going to be really similar on any interior door panel. You're going to have these little covers that are going to cover up the screws here and there inside the door pockets. Really, really common behind the interior handle. So look out for those spots when you're working on any interior door panel on a car or truck. Now that we have everything loose, we're going to want to grab the entire door. And this is actually hung inside the door skin on top. There's a little bit of a lip here. So we're going to want to grab it and firmly lift up and the panel's gonna come right off. As once you get the door panel pulled up, these are really nice. They use these hooks here that actually kind of secure the panel to the inner door skin. So it can kind of just hang on there and it can support itself. So you don't really have to remove any of this stuff. Um, I can get right in here with a five and a half millimeter socket. And here's our speaker. And four bolts is all it takes to get this sucker removed. Pull this speaker out. One connector on the back side. And that's it, you guys. Factory door speakers removed. This thing is blown. Let's go ahead and get the new one. All right, guys, here's the speaker that we just took out, and we know this thing is blown, so we need to replace it. Now we have a huge selection of aftermarket stereo equipment on CarID.com if you want to upgrade your factory speakers. Now this owner doesn't need anything special, so we're actually going to be replacing with the original OE equipment right from Ford Motor Company, and you can now get all of your aftermarket parts and factory OE parts right from CarID.com. That's right, we've expanded our catalog and we now offer OE parts for a slew of popular makes of vehicles, Ford being one of them. So let's go ahead and get the speaker replaced with our brand new Ford OE speaker. This is exactly what you, you can expect to get is if you were to drive down to your local Ford dealer. And as you can see, the exact identical speaker. Let's get it bolted up. All right, first thing we got to do is get this connector plugged in. All right, it's just a matter of getting the four original screws back in. There it goes. All right, and then just do a visual check around the entire door panel. Make sure it's nice and flush. 
all the hooks are on. If you have clips on your door panel, you can go around with your palm and just kind of give it a smack and make sure they snap and lock in. Looks like all our functions work. We'll double check all those. Uh, but now it's just a matter of putting all of those factory screws back into their locations. And I'm gonna start with those two at the very bottom of the door panel, right here. Once again, these are six millimeter bolts at the bottom. One on the outside. One on the inside. Back up top, we had this one that was hiding right behind our inner door handle. cover, firm pressure, snap that back into place, was the one right here in the armrest. Once that's in, get our little cover back on, we're done. All right guys. That's how easy it is to replace a driver's side front door speaker on a 2009 to 2014 Ford F-150. And remember, some of those tips and tricks that I showed you on how to remove an interior door panel, you can transfer to other makes and model vehicles. Don't forget, if you haven't yet, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, stay up to date in all of our DIY product reviews and installation videos. And as always, I'm Greg from CarD.com. I'll see you guys next time.